Hi, my name is uh, Joe Mazuk and I'm from Wood Creek High School in Roseville, California. I am currently the JV basketball coach. I have uh, over 30 years experience uh, coaching men and women's basketball at the high school level and also at the AAU level uh, for quite a few years. Today I'm going to be presenting uh, some inbound plays, basic inbound plays versus zone and man. And I'm going to be starting with zone. Uh, versus zone defense, 2-3 zone, to be very specific. I'm just going to show you how we diagram the 2-3 zone defense very quickly. So here is X3, two forwards, X4, X5 is a center, X1 is two guards, and this is how most teams will defend us underneath our own hoop. Uh, this is uh, going to be an inbound play now versus uh, this 2-3 zone. And uh, we call it triangle in our particular program uh, versus this zone. So you can see the X's are lined up just like you saw them over here to the middle diagram and we set up in a triangle formation and this is the triangle formation here. It's made up between our one, our four, and our five. You can see where they're positioned and our twos are designated inbounder and our three is our safety valve over the top. The X is once again representing the defense that I diagrammed earlier. So the main picture, the main concept of this play is to take X4 defensively and make them our conflict player. So we teach our offensive player two to read X4's alignment, to read his alignment. His current alignment right now is outside of our offensive four. So if he's outside of our offensive four, I'll give you the scheme we clear our four across to the opposite block. We fill our five and replace our four to the near block. We keep our one at three point line extended along the baseline and we take our three and always bring him over the top as a safety valve uh, offensively. Now, if the conflict player once again is outside of our four, the read for our two is to dump the ball right into the five on a lob. Okay, that's our first read. If X4 decides to come inside the key for some reason and not guard his rectangle in a normal 2-3 two, two, zone defensive responsibility, the 2's first read then is to dump the ball to the 1 for an open shot, which is usually a 3. We get a 3 out of this. Um, and his third read then is going to be if the dive is not open based on 4's alignment, and the three's not open, his third read is a safety valve toss over the top to the three. Most teams then uh, will stay in the 2-3 zone after this inbound play and we will go right into a zone offensive scheme to beat this two-man front. This is called a triangle inbound versus zone. At this, at this point uh, in our talk we're going to be uh, learning about how I would stop my own inbound play called triangle versus zone and meaning that how would I defense it? How would I coach my own team to, to defend and stop our own inbound play versus zone? Uh, an interesting scheme that I've, I've come up with over the years is called a split scheme uh, defensively. On the ball side, remember where the offense is setting up in the triangle. We have the one in the corner, the four at the near block and the five at the elbow, three at the opposite elbow. The four's job offensively, remember, is to go across, reseal, the five is to fill, the one is to stay three-point line extended, and the three is to come over the top as a safety valve. That was our triangle inbound play. How would I defend this? I would teach X4, X5, and X1 to be in man on the ball side, meaning man defense on the ball side. That would put X4 out on the one, that would, uh, as the four goes across the key to the opposite block, X5 is manned up with him halfway through the key and then he sends him to a zone player on the back side. The zone players on the back side stay in zone. That's X3 and X2 stay in zone on the back side. X5 just passed him over to three. As the five dives down into this position, X5 is going to go post defense him and really body up to him and not allow him to catch as he fills. X4's manned up, denying that three-point shot from the corner. And 
When three comes over the top, X1 is also in man on this side. He is playing every anything over the top. A lot of times reading that safety valve pass that comes from the two over the top and picking that pass for a layup. Three guys, just to review really quick, three defenders are man, man defense on ball side and two defenders are zone defense on the back side. Split inbound defense will give this triangle inbound play versus zone a tough time being run.